We did it. He didn't do anything, dude. Hey, get out of the way. Silence! Oki okay, didn't do anything! Kutone, awaken! The time has come to glow silver. Grant me the power of the heavens. What the? You suck. <laughs> I don't understand. Why won't Katone awaken? Cause you're bad. Why Katone? Why? Hold it right there, vile serpent. Emmy, is that who I think it is? Behold! Nagi, the greatest warrior who ever lived. And from this day forth, guardian deity of Kamiki village. <laughs> Hear me, vile serpent, who would do violence upon the weak. Your time is up. Feel the wrath of my trusty sword. You are also bad. Shiranui, I don't know why you are here, but Orochi is mine. I shall slay the beast. The time has come. O oh, great gods of the heavens, sweep away these dark clouds. Bear witness as the beast succumbs to my trusty sword, Bokunijin. Wait, this all sounds familiar. Oh yeah, the legend of Nagi. His sword gained power over evil when the moon shined upon it. At least that's what they say. And... Dr draw. Draw. Draw the moon. Draw the moon! Oh snap, his sword, it's... Mm. What devilry is this? My sword, it suddenly blazed gold. It must be the heavens which, which aid me. I shall wield this divine gift with all my might. Naki style blade of truth! Good! Will! Never! Give, uh, give, in, to, Evo. Now for the ultimate Inagi style martial arts. Celestial Cleaver. Reusing animations. Hi. Hey, little girl. Oh, hi. <laughs> yes, we got a new sword. You obtain divine instrument Thunder Edge. Glaive imbued with Thunder Spirit. It utilizes lightning power. That sounds handy. The moment that the legend of Nagi was fulfilled, it was the most beautiful sight one could imagine. Bathed in moonlight, Nagi's sword twinkled reflecting golden light. With Orochi's body cleaved, 
the beast was sealed for a hundred years. The sword was dubbed Sukuyomi and enshrined in the moon cave. Little Lika, at uh, Lika, Lika, the Oina girl who had been tainted by Orochi's dark power, had her curse lifted and returned to normal. However, one man, Oki, did not show such signs of recovery. Orochi's power had interfered with his most desperate attack. Despite the grave danger, Katoni did not exhibit the silver glow. Oki's heart burned at the thought of what Nagi's sword had wrought. Thoroughly humiliated and boiling with rage, he skulked away into the darkness, making sure that no one laid eyes upon him. What a loser! <laughs> what a noob! Get wrecked again, Oroji. Get utterly destroyed. I guess we're going back now, aren't we? Damn. Get cut. Lo 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 lo. Lameo. I have slain the beast. I, Nagi, have defeated the dreaded Orochi. Ah, uh, kind of. We know, we know. Now will you stop repeating yourself? I commend your bravery, Shiranui. But it was I who felled the foul beast. Ah, Lameo Rufflecopter. Yeah, whatever. Furbo here did all the work. Anyway. Where did Oki go? He left without a word. Well, at least we saved Lalika. We should leave. Wait, the... You wrote the Orochi from the past also? What's that Orochi up to now? I thought he was dead. The power from old Orochi also went back to the future? Hey Pops, you better get over here quick. Pops? Owned. Shiranui! Ami! No? That's actually Shiranui. You! You saved my life! Hey! Hey you guys! This battle is far from over! Now get out of here while you still can, while you still have the chance. Is that old man Ishaku? Let's go, dog. What a good dog. Wait, but sure knew he didn't uh anyway, let's get out of here. Sure knew he didn't fight. <laughs> Save the game. Running away. Oh, I have to dodge the dodge the dodge the uh, the dots. Which I don't even know if it's possible to dodge the dots. Running away. Oh, we're all the way back? We're out. You know that wolf who helped Nagi? That was Shiranui. Or in other words, that was you 100 years ago. That was how you met your end after your venture with Grumps. You battled and slew the dreaded Orochi only to die yourself. Except he didn't. Isun, is that you? Hmm, Lika, Dika, it's been ages. Too bad we had to meet like this. What made you go through the spirit gate anyway? 
Spirit Gate? What's that? <laughs> Great answer, Lika. All I remember is two owls appearing in a dream. They invited me to come play with them in the forest. Next thing I knew, I woke up there. Thank goodness you and your doggy came to save me. You had a dream about two owls? Aren't the guardian gods of Kam... Kamui owls? Why would the owls lead you here? Oh no! The eclipse is upon us! Dot dot dot, look at me! The sun! It's starting to wane! The day of darkness is about to begin! This day-long solar eclipse only happens once every hundred years! Day of darkness, what's that? <laughs> That's a great response, Lika. It looks like something's taking a big bite out of the sun. Amy, you're the sun god. What's gonna happen to you if the sun disappears? Sun god, what's that? <laughs> Lika, you can recite that volcanic incantation, can't you? It's supposed to make that frozen mountain east of Fuji erupt, right? Well, you better do it, cause Kamui's gonna freeze if you don't. Volcanic incantation? What's that? <laughs> you mean that prayer we offer to the mountain by the lake? Yeah, I can mimic that prayer of old man Kimu perfectly. He's even told me that I do it really well. I know, I know. That's why we need your help back in the village. Let's go, Ami. Back to Webkia as fast as you can. Uh, excuse me, but... I believe... I have some equipment. And also, since this is the final weapon, don't we also use the uh, the golden dust on it? So can I do it again? Or do we only do it once? Oh wait, we only do it once. So we have a powered up ultimate sword at this point. Let's go ahead and save. I'm a dog with the knife. Aren't we still missing one technique though? Oh, we have to run all the way back out of the forest? Uh, this might take a while. I can, oh, I can teleport back. I just remembered I can use my teleport to teleport back. But I guess we won't teleport back. If I go, do I die if I stay here too long? Or is this, is this the exit already? We don't have to go back through all the all the, all the trees. Oh wow. Hey, it's really dark, guys. Oh hey, there's loot. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> Thank goodness for an eclipse, am I right? Show me that golden peach. <laughs> Alright, so we need to get up here. Maybe it's better if I jump up here. That way I don't, don't need to deal with the monsters. I can't even breathe in this nasty blizzard. We better get to whip here quick. Lika's gonna freeze to death. No, dude, I was jumping up the cliff. Wow. Wow, the game just teleports you. Whoa! Now that's one nasty blizzard. It's blowing in from the rear of the village. Anyway, we gotta get Lika to the altar. We're almost at the edge of Lao Chi Lake. I suppose we are. I meant to put it on the torches. I don't think that helps. Hey, the guy is still selling stuff out here. <laughs> Why isn't he frozen to death yet?
Uh, wrong way. This way. Everything is dark. Spooky. Everything is dark and spooky. Jeez, what's up with this nasty blizzard? What do you, what do you mean, Isu? It's the same blizzard. I, I mean, where the heck does this thing come from? The lake. All right, let us save again. Uh, we need a sword. Huh, I thought everyone would be gathering at the altar while they're all frozen to death. But nobody's here, not even old man Kimu or Samiko. We can't make Lika pray here all alone in this weather. Yes we can. Dark on it, where the heck did everyone go? Uh Wait. <laughs> Do I need to go to the chief's house? Okay, we're not we're not going to the chief's house. We're going up the mountain. But why? Why would we be going up here? The animals are still sleeping in the snow. <laughs> it's okay, we fed them. They'll be fine in this blizzard because we fed them earlier. <laughs> Alright, game. What? Oh, come on. Shouldn't we, like, close the door? Whoa! Everyone's just sitting right here in the snow. What are you doing? Why are you here? What's everyone doing here? Hey, I brought Lika, everyone. So what's up with this nasty blizzard? It's... It's the day of darkness. This day comes every hundred years. Now it's upon us again. That's why the monsters are making the blizzard even fiercer. And Oki, how could he be so irresponsible at a time like this? He destroyed the gate here on his way to the Waku Shrine. What? No, she just told you. I tried to stop him, but he was waving the Katoni sword about. And he was through the gate before I could do a thing. Now Kamui could freeze over whether the eclipse comes or not. Oki suddenly disappeared after we defeated Orochi. Never thought he'd come here and do something like this. What well, he never thought. I bet he just wants to steal all the glory for himself. No, Oki's not like that. I understand why he took the Divine Katoni Sword. He was trying to do what was right for the village. Well, obviously he's wrong. When the two demons got violent at the shrine on Isofuji, it was Oki who came to Kimu's rescue. Huh, I thought it was Semiko was the one who saved Omen Kimu. Oki acted as bait so that Kimu and Semiko could escape. Yeah, but he's still wrong. They survived because Oki acted as their shield and fought for them. Oki is the strongest among us, but even so, he was no match for them. He was lucky to come home alive. Yeah, no, but he's he he's, he's wrong. <laughs> His sword is still not good enough. Wow, that's quite a feat surviving a battle against two demons. <laughs> Two demons, you say? He's fought two demons. How many demons did he fight? Two? <laughs> How many have we slain? But he was angry that he couldn't defeat the demons. Um, you know, being angry doesn't solve your problem. So he took the sword and left the village to fight again. I know it's unforgivable that he stole the sword like that. But he was just trying to do the right thing. Yeah, but he's wrong, Kai. 
doesn't matter what he's trying to do, he's wrong. All he cares about is doing what's best for the village. Yeah, but he's wrong, Kai. It won't be long before the eclipse makes the sun disappear. If the volcanic incantation doesn't start Isu Fuji erupting, Kamui will get colder until it freezes over completely. Please, Lika. We're relying on you to make this work. Dot dot dot. Oki always told me what kind of Oina he wanted to become. He told me to be a good Oina and use my power to help everyone. Do you think it'd help everyone if I prayed like I always do? Who cares about this stupid blizzard? I'm gonna pray for our mountain to come back to life. That's my girl. Let's go, my little warrior. If you don't start the incantation soon, it'll be too late. Alright, you go sit in the snow and chant for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs>